Hello, this is Hawker Bean, and today we are going to be reading SCP-909, also known as Mr. Forgetful. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. I don't remember what, what we were getting into, but let's get into it. Okay, we're on. Item number, SCP-909, Object Class, Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-909 is to be contained in a standard human containment cell. No writing materials are to be allowed inside the cell. A short summary of SCP-909's current situation is to be pasted on the wall beside the bed. Extras are to be provided if the previous summary is removed by SCP-909. SCP-909 is to be fed three times daily with any peanut-free meal. If SCP-909 is seen attempting to write or draw, he is being incapacitated through non-lethal means. Currently, experimentation with SCP-909's effects have been, has been discontinued due to risk of containment breach. Research may be conducted if the site director's approval all is given. As of current regulations on misters, SCP-909 is to be contained in Hall Redacted of Site Redacted. Description SCP-909 appears to be a young, young adult Caucasian male suffering from permanent anterograde amnesia. SCP-909 seems to be aware of his condition but cannot recall experiences past this aside from memories gained due to SCP-909's effects. Hang on, I'm looking up something. Okay, so an anterograde amnesia is the inability to create new memories after an event that causes amnesia. Oh, kind of like um, a movie that I watched called Fifty First Dates. SCP-909's anomalous effects become apparent when it writes down any of the experiences still in its working memory. When described through writing, experiences immediately enter SCP-909's long-term memory. However, the experiences disappear from the memory of all other persons involved. SCP-909 is allergic to peanuts and will, and will go into an anaphylactic shock following the ingestion of any peanut products. SCP was uh, discovered at entrance expunged of site redacted. I'd like to imagine that they just discovered all the e e e e um, little mister or er er or is that uh, are found at, at site entrances all at once by accident? Just like all at the same time, they just wandered or to the SCP Foundation. Addendum: The words "Mr. Forgetful" from Little Mister by Doctor Wondertainment are tattooed upon SCP 909's right calf. Upon discovery, SCP 909 has been wearing a three-piece suit with the brand name Doctor's Orders sewn into the tag. Foundation personnel have yet to find a clothing company operating under this name. So it was probably made by Dr. Entertainment. Addendum 909-2 Further examination of SCP-909's clothing revealed a list of other possible instances of anomalous humanoids similar to SCP-909. See document 909-A inside the left hand's pocket. Addendum 909-3 Interviewed SCP-909 Interviewer is Dr. Amelia Shriven Rem, I know. Anyway, forward. SCP-909 was put into initial observation for seven hours, during which the subjects in interrogated amnesia in relation to SCP-905 were discovered. Oh yeah, 905, that was um, Mr. Chameleon. SCP-909 was then taken in for interview. Good morning, 909. 909, why are you calling me that? And where am I anyways? Read from a sheet of paper. You are the SCP that's dated 909, and you are currently under my custody. I am a doctor of the Foundation, and I am going to research your anomalous effects. 
the foundation what's that why do at this point dr Amelia presses a small button generating a loud noise lasting five seconds scp-909 is seen to lose focus hello 909 909 why are you calling me that and where am i anyways you are the SCP that's a 909, and you are currently under are my custody. I am a doctor of the Foundation, and I am going to research your anomalous effects. The Foundation? What? Okay, let's try something else. Write down what I just told you. Alright, the SCP-909 accepts a pen and stationery and proceeds to write. Lo no, later investigation of Dr. Amelia's notes show that he had planned to uh, she had planned to press a button immediately if she was mentioned at this point. Hey, who are you? I'm the uh, SCP under your custody. Don't you remember? Huh? Don't you remember? No, where am I? What is this place? Closing statement. Dr. Re Dr. Amelia and SCP-909 were removed from the room at the, amid the confusion from all personnel involved in the incident. SCP-909 later explained the situation to uninvolved personnel and was placed to, in his holding cell. Dr. Amelia was discharged from duty and given a Class B amnestic. Addendum 909-2, which is this document 909-A. Which is this? Wow! You just found yourself your very own little mister! A limited edition collection from Wondertainment! Find them all and become Mr. Collector! Zero one is Mr. Chameleon. We already read that one. 02 is Mr. Headless, 03 is Mr. Laugh, 04 is Mr. Forgetful, that's this one, 05 is Mr. Shapey, 06 is Mr. Soap, 07 is Mr. Hungry, 08 is Ms. Mr. Brass, 09 is Mr. Hot, Zero, I mean, 10 is Miss Sweetie, we read that one, 11 is Mr. Life and Mr. Death, 12 is Mr. Fish, 13 is Mr. Moon, 14 is Mr. Red, discontinued. We will read that when I can get at a video done before the sun goes down. 15 is Mr. Money. 16 is Mr. Loss. 17 is Redacted. 18 is Mr. Mad. 19 is Mr. Scary. I think we read that one, or did I just look at it? 20 is Mr. Stripes. I know we read that one. Addendum 9093. The document was shown on, on shown was in the possession of SCP-909. SCP-905 says that it lost its copy in the breeze. The SCP-913 apparently ingested its own copy. SCP-917 had held a similar list, which can be found in document 917A. And SCP-920 claims to have replaced to have misplaced its copy from Dr. Rem. Anyway, that was Mr. Forgetful. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!